The day begins filled with potential, hopes, and dreams. For men and women with intellectual disabilities, there is a community where individual potential is defined by God-given character and talent, where residents are empowered to make choices that lead to personal satisfaction and quality of life, a safe haven for living, learning, working, and growing. The Badur Center opened in 1978 as a faith-based nonprofit. Its specialized programs and services promote intellectual, physical, social, emotional, vocational, and spiritual growth to residents. Its beautiful 120-acre campus in Senatobia, Mississippi is just 45 minutes south of Memphis, Tennessee. It, it's always something going on. And all the time when I'm at home home, visiting home, my parents go to me and say, are you bored? Do we need to do something to keep you occupied? Because I know you have so much going on at the center all the time. If I wasn't here at Bador, I'd be sitting at home doing nothing. Most residents live in supervised group homes where they learn life skills like cooking, household management, and social skills. A warm, comfortable, family-type environment offers each resident a specially tailored living arrangement. Residents who demonstrate a mastery of independent living skills move to transitional homes that offer greater independence and privacy. The Badur Center also offers apartment units for some residents to live at the highest level of independence. When we moved to Memphis, they found the Bedour Center and went and visited and loved it. But I think most important for me, um, as my parents are gone now, I see my brother living his dream the way he wants to live it. And I think for my parents, that's the way they wanted it for all their kids. So we are so thankful that he has a place where people love him and support him for who he is. But now when he comes home, he wants to go back. I mean, that's, that's his home. Those are his friends and his family now. and we are so happy that that is like it is. He has just really grown and it's all because of a door. You know, they've helped in the, with the social skills. Residents' health needs are attended to at the Caffey Clinic on campus. The clinic provides assessment, treatment, monitoring, and follow-up care on site, as well as scheduling and transportation for any needed off-site care. The Badur Center has many programs in place to ensure residents stay active and improve physical fitness, provide socialization, identify and develop talents in the creative and expressive arts, and grow spiritually. The Badur Center has a nationally recognized choir called the Miracles. This ministry travels locally and beyond to perform at places of worship and other venues, all with a mission to glorify God demonstrate the abilities of persons with intellectual disabilities and to tell the story of the Badur Center. Residents are active in the community and enjoy frequent social outings to restaurants, stores, sporting events, movies, and attractions. They also love giving back to the community through service work or special fund drives, like helping to build a community playground or raising funds for St. Jude Children's Research Center. Through the vocational division, Residents have opportunities for employment in a safe and positive environment where learning and earning are encouraged and the development of self-esteem is the most valued product. A variety of on-campus employment options are available, ranging from work activities to customized employment. The Horticulture Division has positions in both retail and agricultural settings. Additionally, residents may opt to serve in grounds, fleet, facilities, and food distribution positions. Badur Custom Packaging offers employment with Fortune 100 and Fortune 500 companies. Compensation for all jobs is set in accordance with the Department of Labor and either meets or exceeds established guidelines. My job is a floor helper. I help out residents prepare their stuff to be in a job where they're getting production. I don't do production jobs. I do hourly. They do production. I think it's great because we are actually working whereas other people don't have jobs and we're glad to have jobs. And it's fun, it's important to the economy and to Bedour Center. Alternative vocational services allows residents to work at their own speed. Staff works with residents one-on-one -on -one to find creative ways to help residents who might not always be willing or able to express their needs. Our education and research division 
works to advance knowledge and understanding of specific characteristics and needs of adults with intellectual disabilities. Internal education allows staff to have more productive interactions with residents. Individual therapy, group counseling, and social skills classes are held, and positive behavior support is provided. An active internship program allows local university students a unique learning opportunity to work with adults with intellectual disabilities and see how they can best be served. When you see the smiles on the faces of the residents and the smiles on the people who work here, it's the greatest reassurance of all. Everything's beautifully maintained. The staff is over and above willing to help you in your decision making, but also be very factual and tell you uh, exactly what you can expect while you're here. A well-rounded, happy life is what we strive to provide for residents at the Badur Center. While parents and guardians pay tuition for the care of their loved ones at the center, tuition alone does not cover the actual cost incurred in the provision of services. That's why support from individuals and companies is so important to help us fulfill our mission to provide a model residential community for adults with mild to moderate intellectual disabilities in an environment that promotes maximum growth intellectually, spiritually, physically, socially, emotionally, and vocationally. It's a place to call home, and home is where the heart is. The Bedour Center. Close friends. A good job. Home.